up, this is Latika and welcome to another video. This week's shout out goes to Yashika. Thank you so much for your lovely comment this week. If you want to check me out on all my other social media platforms, here are all the links. Okay guys, so welcome to today's video. Today's video is my second home decor video. The first one I did was a bathroom transformation. But for today, I decided to kind of revamp this vanity area that I have. And there were very little little components in this area, which I knew that if I could transform them, the entire look, the entire vibe will completely change. So for that, I figured out five DIYs, which I'll be doing on various components that I know will completely transform the look. And not only that, but all the DIYs are are under rupees 500 so i guess let's really jump into diy number one now for diy number one i basically on pinterest saw this kind of black fur and gold automorn but wherever i looked i could not find like a black fur one so i basically got one that was already lying around but it was red in color and it had like a plain silver base and i was determined to transform this into my aesthetic so the first thing that i did was for the silver bottom portion I discovered this beautiful gold contact paper on Amazon and oh my god like the texture because of this is amazing so I simply marked the width and the length I needed to go around the entire thing I cut that piece and then it was a very easy peel out and stick process a few things with contact paper number one make sure that you take out the bubbles initially even if you have to take it out like four five times in the start it's fine Secondly, I had a little bit excess at the bottom so that I could easily fold it and cut it out. Now it came to transforming the red leather into black fur. I basically ordered a black fur cloth from Amazon. Now the fur cloth was a rectangular piece so I first traced out the edges with the help of these bigger pins. I traced a rectangular piece to go around the edge and then there was a small gap so I traced out another rectangular piece to go in that gap. Now with the fur cloth, it didn't make sense to overlap the pieces at all the cloth of both pieces should barely touch each other once the edges were cut out i then secured them i figured that i would use these tiny silver pins first of all they are very long and they'll keep the piece in place and secondly they won't even be visible in the fur so it was like the best solution so i secured the edges and then for the top i had a rectangular piece left i put that on the top of the ottoman and i cut out the exact cloth that i needed and once again i secured them with silver pins now you can put as many or as little as you like none of them are visible at all and that completed my black fur and gold metal ottoman i am literally so in love with this okay the next thing that i wanted to do was kind of create like a sign to go above my mirror so i basically ordered this simple gold metallic wire and i decided to just mold it into a sign that i want i wanted a sign saying love so i started molding the wire according to that at this stage it looks pretty basic and pretty simple but this is just to get the outline of the sign you want correct then i took leftover smaller pieces and started to overlap the same outline line and that started to give a very cool kind of rustic effect to the sign. I did that along the edges of every letter and then did the classic put it under the mattress for the night so that it would flatten out and I made sure that everything was straight and even and this was what the sign was looking like and I am so happy with it. If you want you can even like put this in a frame and you know hang it as like a wall art. Now moving on to the third DIY it is of course the mirror. Now when it came to the mirror for the vanity area i wanted a very simple frameless one it kind of gives the illusion of being very big and seamless but at the same time i wanted a touch of fun and gold to it and when i click like ootd pictures i wanted you know some kind of art some kind of thing to it so what i basically did was from amazon i ordered these little hearts and i decided to create with these like an ombre effect from the edge of the mirror I just carefully put in a little bit of glue at the center of the piece and put it on the mirror where I wanted it. I first sort of created an outline with the distance between each piece increasing and then I filled it in and this was a tedious task but it was really fun and the end result is oh my god so worth it. Coming to the next one it was the most simple thing ever but I think the DIY that made the most difference 
I had a plain stainless steel black Amazon clothing rack and I did the simplest DIY ever that is used spray paint. I'll put the link in the description. The gold color on it was really really nice. So I simply cleaned off each piece of the clothing rack and just started spray painting it. Later on when I got tired, I even assembled the whole thing and just spray painted it like that only standing up. But this is the end result. It is completely transformed and I am loving how it's looking. Now the last DIY, I basically wanted to transform my counter space for the main vanity table. Once again, my most favorite and easiest DIY is using contact paper. In this case, I used marble contact contact paper you know to give the luxurious feel of marble without actually putting it tips for contact paper that don't overlap it because it will be visible if you overlap it once again just try and make the edges barely touch each other and again secondly feel free to remove it like three four times in the start but make sure you get all the bubbles out and you get the positioning just right you have to be a bit careful with this one but the result will be worth it and guys that is it and now that the vanity area is done a next video will be a room tour in detail so let me know if you're excited for that any other suggestions comments thoughts drop them in the comments box and i shall see you guys very soon with another video bye